guys, it's Melissa. Thank you so much for tuning in to the World Slug Burger Eating Championship video in its entirety. I was able to get video from announcing the actual contestants to the contest to who won. Now there is one small glitch in it. Apparently my camera can only take about 30 minutes of footage at a time. So there is a glitch spot right about the 30 minute point. I was able to catch it pretty quickly. Hopefully there's not too much missing there. So they were in the middle of announcing the winners when that happened. Hopefully that's not too much of a problem for you. Other than that, it is in its entirety and completely unedited for your viewing pleasure. So let's get to it. Major League Eating, take it away. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going on a long journey of self-discovery and we're going on that journey by eating slug burgers. The official slug burgers of this championship are from White Trolley, the official slug burger of the World Slug Burger Eating Championships. Ladies and gentlemen of Corinth, Mississippi, and the world, we have reached the end of human history. There is no more looking back. There are no more tales to tell. There is only right here and right now. Tomorrow will take care of tomorrow. And here, under this blue umbrella sky, we await the swing sword of justice wielded by the Almighty herself to behead the weak and to raise up the pure of heart. For this is the World Slug Burger Eating Championship. There is no bigger stage in all of world sports. Now is the hour when glory calls and only the bravest are left standing to answer. You, sir, you have waited no more than six minutes for this contest to start, but I, and these weapons of mass gurgitation about to take the stage. We've been waiting our entire lives. Waiting, but not preparing. You can't prepare for something this awesome. It's like falling in love, or like hang gliding. And right now we are perched on the cliff edge of all of our dreams. Right here, in this sanctum, sanctorum of salvation. This Mount Sinai of mastication. This Colosseum of competitive eating. Four words. Let the contest begin. Let it begin. Let it begin. Let it begin, brother. Let's try. Track two there, John. Are you all ready to meet those who will eat? Let's bring out our first contestant, ladies and gentlemen. She claims to have been working on her debut here today for the past 40 years. She told me, she told me that each and every birthday she celebrates by eating an entire chocolate cake. But I want to clear something up. She does this by choice. It's not because no one shows up at her party. Ladies and gentlemen, from Corinth, Mississippi, Hope Bain. Our next contestant, ladies and gentlemen, comes from Tampa, Florida. Three things you don't know about Tampa, Florida until right now. The chief export of Tampa is phosphate. Two, it has never actually reached 100 degrees Fahrenheit in Tampa, Florida. And three, this guy's from Tampa. Please welcome Brian Jackson. Our next contestant is the undisputed slug burger eating champion of Corinth, Mississippi. He returns to this table once again to defend Corinthian honor against eaters from far lands, ladies and gentlemen. Does he stand a chance today against Joey Chestnut? Absolutely not! But is he here to try? He is! Ladies and gentlemen, one of your own, Jeff Stark! Thanks, right. 
There we go. An eating contest in Corinth, Mississippi without our next contestant is like a day without sunshine. A day dimmed by the absence of her radiance. That is because her smile could heat the nation of Canada and her kindness could tenderize a shoe, making it suitable for human consumption, perhaps in a pot roast or in a stew. Last year on this stage, she ate just three slug burgers. She seeks revenge. Please welcome Ayla Poo. Ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant is a computer analyst and the inventor of the Etatron 3000, a robot that can scientifically work out the results of any eating contest. Simply punch in the data, the food type, the contest length, the prevailing wind conditions, the addition or the subtraction of gluten is their ranch dressing. We ran the Etatron 3000 backstage and here are the results of today's contest. A lot of slug burgers gonna be eight. That is science! Please welcome world number 34 from Allentown, PA, Wild Bill Myers. in just eight, ladies and gentlemen. On this stage last year, he ate 11 and one quarter slug burgers in just 10 minutes. He's eaten eight pounds of pie in eight minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome world number 33, the man who needs no nickname, Matthew Rainbow. Contestant, ladies and gentlemen, does not eat food. He bullies food into submission. He bullies food and then he takes food's lunch money. And then he takes that lunch money and he buys more food. And then he bullies that food. And the cycle of pain and torment continues from now until the last bird has flapped its wings, ladies and gentlemen. But it's not called competitive nice. It's called competitive eating. Please welcome world number 29 from Maryville, Tennessee, Sweet Tooth, Matthew Cohen. <laughs> 253 oysters in five minutes. 25 Nathan's famous hot dogs and buns in 10 minutes. To celebrate Elvis' birthday, he ate 16 and a half peanut butter and banana sandwiches. He's eaten 118 chicken wings in 10 minutes. Rate number 25 in the world. Number one in the great state of Texas. From Keller, Nasty Nate Phillips. Ladies and gentlemen, last weekend, he fell asleep on the couch watching a Game of Thrones marathon. And as a half-eaten grilled cheese sandwich rocked up and down on his belly, the drool slid down the right side of his face on to the new cushions. And as he slept, he dreamt. He dreamt of great battles, not fought with swords or dragons, but with teeth and jaws and stomachs. In his dreams, he led a great army of competitive eaters against an evil slug burger a mile tall and five miles wide. And under his leadership, they ate and they ate and they ate until they were victorious. And then his girlfriend woke him up and said, hey, I need the remote. Real Housewives is on. Ladies and gentlemen, world number 
with a graduate degree of physics who a little over a year ago decided to finally do something with his life which is why he became a major league eater he is already ranked number six in the world 28 and a half new jersey pork roll sandwiches 36 and three quarter hot dogs and buns a very masculine man a muscular man from oxford massachusetts jeffrey espar You know what this song means. You know who our last contestant is. You know you are in the presence of greatness. He is part human, all American, the living embodiment of everything we hold dear in this great republic. And each and every time he stands at this table and opens his mouth, a giant beam of light shoots forth to illuminate the path forward in the dark times, my brothers and sisters. If he was born in France, his name would have been Joseph, and presumably he would have eaten a lot of croissants or chocolate egg there. But he's not from France, he's from America, and the rock upon which he stands is not made of earth, nor dirt, nor stone. It's made of hope, it's made of love, it's made of faith. And brothers and sisters, it is strong. I give you the number one ranked here in the world, the great Joey Chesna! Let's pause right there. Let's pause and start the music on my cue. Come out the front. Okay. Come forward. You, you can't just work in the back. What's your name? Scott Sawyer. Scott Sawyer. Unless anyone has real objection. I know what it can be like in city life. I don't know this gentleman's bona fides. We just met. He seems like a regular guy. He's going to be our timekeeper. Because he was there when I said, where's my timekeeper? <laughs> Sometimes success or failure, we haven't even got there yet. Sometimes it's going to be a success, I like the confidence. Sometimes it's just about being in the wrong place at the right time, and so you were. I want you to stick with me and I want you to yell in my ear. It's a 10 minute contest. You can either use a countdown function or a stopwatch function, whatever you feel comfortable with. You ready to do this? All right, I like your attitude. Eaters, are you ready? Yes. <laughs> All right, shush. In case anybody doesn't know, this is Joey Chestnut. Joey Chestnut is the number one ranked leader of the world. Joey Chestnut is the greatest leader in the history of mankind. Joey Chestnut holds 42 world records, but does not. As of right now, hold the world slug burger eating record. He wants to leave Corinth, Mississippi with a medium sized hangover, hopefully not one that's too big. And the world slug burger eating record. Joseph, are you ready to do this? Ready. Like there's such a thing. Corinth, help me count it down on the time honor tradition. Get on it, brother. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's go! Get off.
rotating the slug burger. Rotating the slug burger as we go around. One minute gone, eaters. There is nine minutes to go. Nine minutes does not sound like a long time, but nine minutes long can be better than any triple here in Corinth, Mississippi. It can feel like an eternity. It's nine minutes where each and every man and woman at this table is asking themselves deep questions. Questions about the decisions they've made in life. Questions about who they are as a person. And as Joey Chestnut reaches for slug number nine, he is on pace to break the Sony's world record. The question will be whether or not he truly wants it and how hard he's willing to work. If Jeffrey Esper can push him to great things, he is today. Esper is working on what appears to be slug number eight. We'll check in with Nasty Day Miller, working on slug number six, the lucky six. He's absolutely neck and neck with Josh Miller and Sweet Tooth Matt Cohen. So if I just stand here for the rest of the contest and talk about Hope Bane, she'll get a lot of air time and I'll be in condition. But I can't do that, it's a serious thing. Let's talk, Maury! Jeff Stark, the Atmosphere Slug Burger in the Champion of Corinth, Mississippi. He is a big local honor and local pride. While Bill Byers brought his own condiments. Joey Chester has already got 15 slugs down. Where are we at, Scott? What are we looking at? Oh, ho! We are on pace! We are well and truly ahead of world record pace. If Chester can maintain the first... Oh, sister, don't you do what your big sister... Three minutes gone! Seven to go! On Josh Miller. Sister, don't you? Josh Miller is grinding. There's no two ways to put it. I'm not sure if he's found his rhythm in his contest again. Sir, the time might expire. Nice and then you run. Sister, don't you do what your big sister does. This is a 10 minute event.
the real glory is will be if Chester or another contestant can break that magic 43 and leave Carlos Mississippi with the world slug burger eating record, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, on Monday, four minutes to go! Four minutes to go, Corin! You are not applauding! You are looking bemused! You don't know what's going on! I demand applause! If you want to see history, do your part! The more you cheer, the more they will eat! You will support him! You will support him! Three minutes to go! Like the universe, their stomachs are expanding, ever expanding, ladies and gentlemen, out into the unknown. They're tipping to balance the carbohydrates, the delicious protein, the lean protein of the slug burger. A reminder that these slug burgers are from White Polly. When it comes time to choosing us slug burgers, choose the slug burgers that champions come. The champions chew white trolley exclusively. They are elite slug burgers that are designed to speed. Pro grade slug burgers. Approaching two minutes to go. I'm seeing 35 now on the chest. If he can finish two more of these plates, the world record is here. for all our contestants. I'm going to go through and tally these results. DJ John, hit the next track. Keep these people occupied. I'll be right back here with the results in one minute. Thank you. Oh, I think that I found myself a cheerleader. This woman is my destiny. She told me don't worry about it no more. She said, ooh. Shut up and watch me, watch me, 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 me. It's been a long day, but we were victims of the night. We've come a long way. Don't be scared, cause I'm your body type. All my life is still by me. Girl, you're the one.
I timed today's contest impeccably so that we could all enjoy Norfolk Southern. You can tell it rings in E flat. The train guy, what can I say? <laughs> it's ridiculous. DJ next track! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we're paying down to fourth place. But there is no fourth place finisher today. We have a tie for third. They will share the combined points of third and fourth. Matt Cullen and Josh Miller, ladies and gentlemen, with 17 and a half. Nathan's famous hot dogs and buns. In doing so, he restored honor to the chestnut name, returned himself to the number one position in the world rankings, and claimed his number. But that was then! And time marches ever forward! And those who look to the past for validation are always, always found wanting! It is about the here and now! And by that I mean what happened three minutes ago. Because in ten minutes, this man ate 41 slug burgers in 10 minutes for the win. The oversized novelty check come forth, madam, and presented unto Joseph Christian Chestnut. 41 slug burgers in 10 minutes. Ever so close to breaking the world record, but it is he and only he who for the next 12 months can walk the streets and avenues of the world. And when people look at him, he can say, I 
and not you are the world slug burger eating champion. Joey Chestnut, ladies and gentlemen, the glory is his, the joy is ours. Thanks again to all in Corinth for your beautiful hospitality in this beautiful patch of the world. God bless America and get home safely. Thank you. Guys, thank you so much for watching my video, but don't stop there. There's that video and this video and that subscribe button. So get to subscribing and get to watching. And I am so happy to have you on this journey with me. Happy travels.